At the hair salon where I had my hair cut, the three gay hairdressers, as they watched the final episode of Ngayon at Kailan Man, now and forever in unison, commented the teleseries final episodes was lame. I guess the hairdresser's comment rooted in a worn-out storyline of most soap opera shows on TV where lovers ended up in a church wedding if not with a happy ending. When Eno and Eva, the main characters of the telenovela, ended in their tragic death, that was beyond their expectation. For them, it was lame, and they were unsatisfied. In 1992, a movie of the same name, with the same theme song, starred Sharon Coretta and Richard Gomez, Climax 2, with And They Leave Happy Day. Of the same theme and title, GMA, ABS, CBN's TV rival stations, in 2009 reprised the movie Mayor Kailanman for their own teleserie. It starred Hart Evangelista and JC Rivera. The GMA saw ended with a church wedding. Filipinos never get tired. The ABS-CBN put up their own version of Ngayon at Kailanman in 2018. It starred Julia Barreto as Eva and Joshua Garcia as Ian. Star Creators, the show producer, veered away from the usual theme and treatment. They ran countered against the popular wish of the Filipino soap opera lovers. The producer pursued one theme of the classic Romeo and Juliet. They made their central characters, Eva and Kino, met their tragic death, which conciliated the two warring families. Treading along this theme was a gamble. Filipinos hate the sappy ending. Star Creatives invested on treatment. Their pilot episode alone stunned me and I guess the TV viewers. In a blazing speed, it showcased a patriarch funeral, leaving a huge inheritance. Five killings, an abducted baby, a cinematic montage, gorgeous photography. Then the alternating pluses of three children fighting for their lives. Lots of evils and stake happened at once. The fast pace differentiated this soap from the usual dragging technique of most soap opera, which annoyed the TV viewer to death. Alice Dixon is Stella is a revelation. Her portrayal of a soul disturbed with guilt through her eyes, then released a nonchalant manner of her schemes captured me. Isa Calzado Rebecca raised the barometer of her acting too. Both carried the emotional class to move the story of the feuding families. Two astounding bookend scenes evolved Ngayon at Kailanman in a pool circle, a cinematic technique absent from earlier version. When Ino and Eva searched for her origin at the top of the lighthouse, a black hole flew over at the sky. When Rebecca visited Ino and Eva's grave in a grassy knoll, the same hope appeared again. In the beginning, as children to show that Ino and Eva are spiritual soulmates, they met at the white portal of lights. After James and Blake, Ollie, killed them, they met at the same white portal of light, ascending this time to heaven.